Good morning, fellas. We're out here in a field again today. Got a bunch of full bodies out here. We got the A-frames, they're brushed in really good. Got the grass coming over the top and coming in from the front, kind of hiding that big open black hole of the blind. There's been a few birds in this field, you know, maybe two, 300 or so. Um, my hope is that they come in small groups so then we're able to get more shooting opportunities. But nonetheless, hey, we're out hunting. We can't hunt ducks right now, duck season's closed. So it's just honker time and uh, just four of us today. So nice little four man honker hunt. If we can get a few birds in the bag, maybe 10, 15, it'll be a good day. But got some clouds, got some snow. A lot of you guys like to nitpick the blinds being in the field. It works most of the time, but sometimes it doesn't. And then if the off chance that it doesn't, we will resort to going to the tree line as a last ditch effort. Geese hate trees. They will not land going into trees. We've got a pretty good amount of space from the tree line here that I think we're gonna be pretty good, but in the off chance that the birds are not wanting to play with this stuff, we'll move to the tree line and see what happens, but we'll keep at it. Got the 12 gauge today for all you 20 gauge haters, and uh, we're gonna start hunting. <laughs> Are they just stretching their wings or? Take them, boys, out the back. Nice shooting, guys. Look at the feathers. <laughs> Good boy, Max. Come on, bring it. Good boy. Stop. First group did it pretty good. We had to shoot them behind us, but uh, I think we got five or six out of that. So come on, Max. Get inside. I'm happy. That was that Get was inside. definitely a good group. Um, Get inside, Max. They're kind of playing around. There's not much wind right here, so. That kind of makes things a little bit difficult, but hopefully we can get some more because there's a lot of birds flying right now. Um, we'll see what we can do. Well guys, I've been trying to decide if I'm gonna post this video or not, and uh, I obviously am. This is a good example of a hunt where, you know, you scout, you get a few birds in a field, you go hunt them and try them. I didn't go into this hunt thinking we were gonna shoot very many birds, you know, maybe 10. Um, we ended up only shooting five, just one group came through. We had a couple of birds kind of play around with us, but it was just kind of a weird hunt. Nothing that we did really affected if the birds were going to come in. It was just the birds didn't want to be there. So that's how it worked. We had one group that did pretty good. And between four of us shooting, we got five birds out of one group. I think we could have gotten a lot more if we were all aiming at the same birds. I was looking at the shot cam on this and... Um, you could see multiple shots going at multiple birds and you know it kind of sucks when you see that happening because if people pick different birds which is incredibly hard to do um, most of the time if you're hunting in a group of four or five chances are at least one bird is getting double tapped by two people or three people so um, I think if we aimed at different birds on that one pass we would have got it got quite a few birds uh, more than we did, but you know, that's just kind of how it goes. Not every hunt's a banger Sometimes you just kind of go through those mediocre hunts where you know You get one two three four birds and uh, it's still a good day. I enjoyed it It was nice being able to hunt with Adam again Levi Steve It was just a good day. I I've got nothing to complain about 
So I hope you guys enjoyed that one one little clip of uh, some goose hunting. It's getting towards the end of the season. Got a few weeks left to make it count, and I've got duck season opening up this weekend, which I'm really excited about. I haven't hunted ducks in a very long time, so I'm really looking forward to that, and hopefully I can get on some green heads. If you guys like this video, make sure to leave me a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button if you have not already. It means a lot when you guys do that. So... That's about it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will catch you on the next one.